Morning. <coughs> what? Is... Uh... Oh. Yeah, that's that's right. So I'll sleep in the living room. There's some cookies for me, for you, right here. So, you, uh, yeah, you can just do that. Oh, uh, th thanks. Uh, I'm gonna need to take a moment to wake up. I think. Well, you know. Did you sleep out here too? It's... <sighs> just, just eat your cookie, and I think I hear them uh, waking up. And I, I, I will do some cookies. a little tight, but it'll work itself out as the day goes on, I'm sure. Oh. Morning. Okay. Morning. I thought I saw you go out. Yeah, looks like they just got an early start. Nine, morning. 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 Yuki. Good morning, Tao. Good morning, Abby. Do you sleep all right? about today. It seems a little, uh, a little gray in the sky. Uh, not in the face yes. I wanted to see first in the morning. 
Is there what are you doing here? Tell school kids are the best quality. They're even better than they want in the Screw academy. It. Hey, Talia. Good morning. Uh, hi, Talia. I was going to wake you up, but you were in your room. Oh, no, I thought. Isn't it early. way better than the ones in the Trying academy? To catch something. Hmm. I, I They're guess the so. same ones as the ones in the academy. How could it be better? It's just the better ones. Just tell made it with love. Because it's in a. <laughs> Did you tell? Mm. You Did you really taste love the love? Uh, I, I try, I suppose. Why are you night, doing Emma? this game here for cookies? Yeah, we're not for a run. Oh. Which we're also supposed to do yeah. now. Why are you taking a long time <laughs> eating? Uh, I'll, 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 I'll eat in the jog. I'll eat in the jog. Okay, let's go. Uh, uh, that's fine, not fine. good for cramps. Be careful. It's, it's, you know, it's up to you. Lead the way. Why are we jogging? Oh. Bye. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I need to be going to get the attack lab. So I'll be going there now. If you need me, just go there. Got it. To the third floor of the main building. Hmm. Goodbye. <sighs> well, everyone has a busy morning, it seems. You two have any daring adventures this morning? Hmm. Not that I can recall. I suppose I do still need to uh, head the direction of the school, though. Might as well. Cookies are nice, but we should probably see about packing some snacks and stuff for later in the day, or just make sure that we have breakfast. Either or works. We should probably head that direction. Just to get the stomach started. Yeah, yeah. That's uh, why you put oatmeal in it. Kind of helps with that. Mm. Hello, Captain. Morning, Captain. And Ventus. Howdy. Morning, Jack. Morning. Are my feet in in the uh, on the ground? Uh, just just, just yeah, just question. just your heel, just your heels. My heels? It's probably just the way that you're standing. How about, uh, how about now? Yeah, yeah, that looks about right. You're more than fine. Okay, okay. Yours are, um, it looks mu looks like it's kind of muddy. Where you're standing. Yeah, just a little bit. There, there it is. Okay. Oh. Um, Mertes just woke up in our sink. Oh. How how do you how do you get in there? We were thinking maybe it was the back door, but everything should have been locked. Very odd, very very odd. I have no idea. Climb in through the balcony. That sounds dangerous. I think I would have oh, seen him. I was sitting up there. Uh, what's going on today? I don't, I don't. Well, we usually wait. I know. I wish there was like more of a system going on. Oh, Octavian class, right? Yeah. Mm. To, to whatever that's gonna be. Yeah. Hmm. Probably 
Hopefully we get more news in. Okay. Main up cruise. Huh. Not exactly the most uh, chipper news, but I suppose it could be uh, even worse than that. Yeah. Look, yeah, what, is that something new on it? Um, not really. No. It's just mostly the, mm. the basic struggles of, uh, uh -huh. I suppose, the cities and, and continent. Hmm. I'm not sure. I know in A6 that seems pretty normal for local news. Any big plans for you or Terra today, or...? I, I haven't felt the need to call them all together and, and tell them something. Um, no, I suppose we're just waiting for, you know, the uh, Octavius class and then, and then the Chancellor will fix us if there's anything important. Hmm. I think I'll walk today. Not yet. Do you want food? I'll have some later. You uh, make sure to feed yourself first. Don't you want some food now? You need it. <laughs> My uh. My appetite's a little off this morning, but I will eat just a little bit later. Once my stomach starts agreeing with me, I guess. to the infirmary real quick. Uh, okay. Yeah. I'm gonna have a, a bit of a spontaneous lesson on burn wounds. Mm. You'd see him out on burns himself when he tripped with the tea kettle. Oh. Yeah, yeah, um, okay. Yeah. No. Thank you. They should be taking them here now. Yeah, I'm great. I'm gonna. Look, look, this. Sorry. I don't know how much you've been uh, talking to Yuki lately. Has she said anything out of the ordinary? I suppose. I don't like whatever's going on with uh, Skya. We've been putting responsibility. She hasn't said anything. Oh, Zuki, did we tell you that we're we're we we're, we're mm. responsible for that one now? Oh, yeah, we were supposed yeah. to go on. Yeah, Thank I you. I had a jog, so I was gonna go on one myself. All right. Now. How do you have to see this? Morning, Emma. Pa! Morning. Just put two pieces of paper with drawings on them. This is what I have. I won't be talking, but I went down with them all night. What? What is it? Is that... My tattoos! Oh! Oh, I see now. Hmm. Fairly elaborate, but definitely doable. 
That's a very nice design. You drew this? I did what I could. Yeah. I had the best of drawing, but I did a little bit of drawing, you know. And this is... This is what you're going with, you're sure? And I'm so early. Absolutely sure. Absolutely, totally sure. I had a lot of time to think about it. I already double tapped on both of these. Okay. Mm-hmm. Huh. Mm -hmm. oh. I suppose so. The designs are nice. Where exactly were you looking to get these? Uh, I want the big one on the back and the small one on the hip. Oh. Alright, yeah. That should be, um... A good amount of working space. Yeah. <laughs> Looks like we're actually doing this. That's good. We're actually doing this. I've been, uh, committed. I've been excited to try and get back into it. It's been years, but... Morning. Morning, Professor. I didn't mean to interrupt. Hmm. Just, uh, chatting, trying to get going in the morning, I suppose. Um, here, you can have these back. Well, well you need them. You're the one doing the job. Uh, do I even have... Probably have... Let me just fold it up. Mm. Mm. Uh, that one. Yeah, okay. Today might end up being a busy day, oh, so, uh, make sure to, uh, make sure to make sure for Eddie's. As far as when we'll do the tattoo, uh, we'll have to find free time. Probably at some time during the evening, if nothing else comes of it. If not, maybe sometime tomorrow we can start. It'll be a long process, because we have two tattoos and they're fairly intricate, but should be able to work out. Mm. Mm -hmm. Everything go alright? Well, was that foraging? Uh, Everything okay, right? Yeah. Uh, no. Uh, you foraging? Just, okay. I just, Is there an expedition today? I, I don't know. I, I thought I, I, I thought I saw this. Hmm. I must say, it's quite my time. Who burns themselves? In this academy, uh, maybe I can make it to that. Uh, oh, okay. yeah, I hope they can finish fast enough. Right mm. Oh, oh him. Him. Feeling better? I'm Oh, yeah. I'm burnt up. That's great. Uh, fantastic. Oh, I had to restart. You could be a marshmallow, in my opinion. I see. It's a bit of a what? Marshmallow? Yeah, I heard it's like a tiny pillow. Small and wide and soft. Jensen Malik was able to keep Yiko from burning. You should be fine. Don't worry. Never heard of that. Mm. Uh, at least one of the, what the boatman said when he came to my dad with uh, his uh, stuff. It's a marshmallow, tiny little squishy thingies. I suppose so. Maybe they're training with valves. And, what's it, what's it mean to be and these are edible? Mm. Uh, it's yeah, at least that's what, what he said. Sorry, I think I misunderstood something. Although, those, those chefs meant they could eat anything, so... I, I, I'm not completely sure. Oh, yeah, that's true. Where? Well, he does seem to do a good job. Further away from me. Are you sure you're not going to eat anything? Only one. Or burn. Didn't you say we'd have a busy day? Uh, I suppose I should probably uh, not be a hypocrite. <clears throat> okay. I can get food for you. They all can get the dark. Do they respond to me? Do you, do you have a concept of mm. me? He's a big boy. He can walk by himself. Yeah. If, if you need, I'll, uh, I'll be right back. 
If a man can't go and get his own food, then what can a man do? Then what's a man worth? So, whoever gave it has a pet in Dari. I have a word. Let's try not to get on that bad side. Well, he didn't name it, and we are the ones housing it. This is for you too, you We offered it, but I think it's simply for you. Child, you have a big appetite. It's like I can never I think I will need it. I'll just go ahead and uh we can wear out the Besides, I'll just pass it on to the. Very weird to see. I mean, it's not an entire house. Mertash usually finishes everything. Yeah, that's the good side of it. Still, like the garbage and the eats whatever he wants. Like uneaten. The bone's strong. And the muscles. That's quite interesting. I must admit, I've met him only like two, three times, but I know. I'll do what you gotta do. Oh, good morning, Kingsley. Oh, you, 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 you eat me too. I don't really see you eat it at all. Good morning, Kings. I I just saw. Uh, <clears throat> I I need to finish up. And what do you eat? Find someone else to finish this food. Oh, that's my cue. Uh, could you instruct some of the meeting face? See you in a bit. <laughs> Likewise. Thank you. Oh, I should probably get today. Make sure everyone is comfortable. I don't like some foraging going on. Good morning. Morning. students. So, we have a couple things planned for today. The first thing we have planned is all students today would be training with Octavian in rotating classes. Now, I believe the first class was... Yes, I apologize. I had a little bit Sorry. of uh, issue with my head. Please. Uh, I was just saying, uh, which of the two teams you'll be taking uh, first? To, uh, for the first two teams, it will be Umbra and Ignis. As I believe those were the two. And then next was... I believe it was Terra and Lumen? I'm not sure. I, I'll ha I will have to look at my notes from earlier. Well, Maybe it's wrong. Terra and Lumen then. And then, the last two will be after that. So, when the first of the red bell rings, Umbra and Ignis will report to the uh, arena. Well, meanwhile, the rest of you, if you would like, uh, the... There will be a foraging expedition with uh, Miss Bellicosa and Professor Mordred outside the, the walls of the school, past the barrier. And so if you wish to join in that, please meet them at the, 
at the gateway. Is this understood? Mm, yes, sir. Yes, yes sir. Yes. Sir. yes. Uh, where are we meeting Octavian again? At the arena. So first two squads will be Ignis and Umbra. Once the bell rings for your squads, you'll be notified. Mm. The rest of you can feel free to join us as we forage and hunt while you wait for your turn. Understood. All right. Any further questions? All right. Then you are dismissed. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Oh, I'm finding my team. <laughs> my apologies for being a bit tardy. Uh, I'll be on my way. Hmm. Do you still have that need to talk with Tao? Apparently he's in the mess hall currently. So if you he's behind. He's over there. Oh, he's in the mess hall. Hi, Tao. Uh, uh, are you busy right now? Can I talk to you for a bit? Uh, of course, Professor. Just give me one moment. We'll talk. All right. There's, okay, two of you. Uh, everyone else? Yeah, I just came from my AD tech class. Just around, probably. Okay. Right, I'm gonna go have sure this talk. Everyone so today we're having lessons with uh, Professor Octavian. It's gonna be in basically shifts. We're having ours later in the day. We have to wait for the third bell to ring for today. So for right now, just um, sit tight. If you, well, if you would like to, uh, Professor Bellicose and Mordred are going foraging and hunting. You're welcome, more than welcome to help them. Just uh, make sure to keep tabs and if you need anything to get in touch with someone. Especially if it's a professor, they can t contact me directly. Yes. Other than that, not too much going on today aside from those two main objectives. Well, I was just asked by the by the by the other tech professor what we were going to be doing today. I, may, maybe I can go back. Perhaps. Excuse me. Yuki, what about you? I don't, I don't want to do it when I do it again. Uh, I'm, I'm waiting for Skyette right now. Uh, is there medical today? You and Skyette talk a lot. Yeah, certainly does. And I am unsure. I do not believe that the divisions are meeting up, but if I'm, if you talk to them, I'm sure... Actually, there won't be any division work today. Yeah, I'm sure they'd still take questions if need be. It was for me. Okay. Well, speaking of which, he's over here. Yeah. Whatever the case, just keep tabs on each other. Let me know if you need anything. I'm likely to be around campus and not too far out of reach. All right. Mm. All right. I should be good now, Professor. All right then. Uh, let's let's walk over to outside if you and um, that's uh, I'll, uh, I'll just need to talk to you and inquire about a few things that you. Gave me a couple of days ago, yes? Hmm, yes. I'm gonna forage. Uh, Are you going on the forage yeah. thing? Right. I didn't plan on it. This way. Oops. This way. Sorry? I think the chance that I forgot to tell him that. Upsetting, Kiki. Upsetting. He did forget about your. Over here. Hmm. That's a good enough spot. Yeah, very good. I like the spot. So I believe you. Hmm. I got I got your letter the other day, and I believe you were saying you're you're interested in a little dabbling in a little bit of alchemy. Is that right? I do. I have just recently learned that alchemy also technically falls into other branches of chemically kinds of stuff that I thought was eh, mundane in comparison. Uh, mundane, yeah, but also I just realized very useful. There were these um things. Back in Rosa that I saw. They were imported from some other place, I don't even remember. But they were like long shafts, and they had like these columns on the end of it filled with like uh, some kind of special powder and some other concocted materials and things like that. And they, they, they spewed forth like a small, like colorful explosive. And well, like it was very interesting to me. I don't know how I got this idea, but. 
my spear. I was wondering if you knew if there was a way for us to, maybe with some help from Professor Oberdeen or what have you, or at least, or at least the forge that's up there, try and find a way to uh, kind of change the head of my spear a little bit around, so that way it could basically be filled with a similar kind of agent. I want to sort of bridge the gap that I have in combat to um, be able to expel forth an explosive of some kind, or perhaps some kind of other alchemical reagent, maybe flames? I'm unsure yet, but whatever capabilities may, may be, I think oh, that cool. I uh, want to look into it. Oh, your timing is right, young cow. Uh, we've been, I've been um, slowly introducing advanced alchemy to uh, the alchemy division, and this is a perfect chance for you to uh, be able to, you know, acquire said explosives. I, th I think what you're, what you're um, describing here is some sort of explosive or some elemental resin on the tips of your spear to add an extra punch, hmm. uh, if I'm not wrong. Hmm. Yeah, just A little just, bit of gunpowder would be perfect on this. Or we can, we can add some elemental res resins if you would like a bit more or like a, uh, or like a fire spear or, or anything like that. It's quite interesting, but... However, this is this is quite advanced alchemy. If you know if you're catching my drift, how? What's your um? What's your what? What's to call it? What's your affinity with the alchemy? Have you mastered the basics in any sort of way? Well, I don't know if I have. Uh, which, I guess, optimistically speaking, means that I have uh, plenty of catching up to do. But I'm willing to put in the work. Hmm. Perfect. Well, the best, the easiest way to get through this is join the alchemy division. But I don't know if you are already full uh, in your in your workload with the divisions. Do you have uh, Do you have any in it in it in you to have an extra space for alchemy? I am currently part of two divisions: the crafting and the muscle. I think perhaps if I talk to Professor Caldwell, yes, I might be able to take at least a little bit of time to do that. Well, there's also another way if you if you uh, wanted to work with those divisions a bit more. I do know that. Uh, let's see. Three of your uh, three of your Ventus members are part of the Alchemy Division. Let's see. Mm -hmm. There's young Talia. There's yeah, young Yuki and young um, Emma. Yes, mm -hmm. they can uh, probably assist you. Uh, uh, discuss with them a little bit, and we can make something out of it. Uh, they 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 can help you out um, de developing a little bit about it. Um, hmm, what's, it's a little bit tricky here, but I can probably work out with them as well. But I just want you to inform them that you have a little bit of your own project in your hands. And, yes, I think that's, that's quite good. Mm. Interesting enough, though, if, if you're down to learn a little bit yourself, feel free to contact me at any time. I'm, I know you're, you're very busy, but I would love to uh, talk more about what you'd like and how we can customize this even further. Maybe we can even make it a throwing spear and make it go... You, Throw it and it explodes! Kaboom! But then mm. you probably run out of spears really quick. Yes, well, yes. We can, we can workshop this. Yeah, definitely. Anyways. I believe you. Is there anything else you'd like to discuss about me? For me? Uh. Just perhaps a, another time that we can probably talk about this. Maybe sometime tomorrow? Of course, of course. Don't worry about it. And if there's anything else you would like to speak about, uh. I'm always free, I think. Uh, I'd love to chit chat about all the going ons around him, so don't fret about it. Excellent. I'll try and see if I can make a. maybe like a pound cake or something. Something good with tea. Uh, might as well try and contribute something. Ooh. You know, alchemy, alchemy division isn't just all about alchemy. We also like cooking stuff. If you're, if you're down to brew some nice tea, a little bit of a drink, or some nice. Ah, uh, nice food. Uh, alchemy. Uh, cooking is just uh, edible alchemy, as they say. Hmm. I've never heard that before, but... Strangely makes a lot of sense. It seems I've, uh... Exactly. Really missed out on one of my potential options for a division. Whoops. <laughs> you know, when thinking about it, I should have probably explained a bit more. <laughs> a bit more, uh, you know, a bit more on what, what the alchemy division does. Because there are some people in the alchemy division that aren't the most proficient. So I decided, you know what, for them we can, we can make it a bit more inclusive. Let's, let's add cooking to the mix. So, you know. 
<laughs> well. Anyways, I probably take. I'm taking too much of your time. I believe you have. If you probably have other things to do. Ah. Unless you'd like to join us in the uh, scav scavenging trip. Uh, I've been thinking about it. You're gonna but... be collecting some nice. Hmm. I think I might it's, see it's about uh, some other things. But if I don't have anything else to do, I might just meet you all out there. All right, then. It'll be a jolly good time, if, if any, in any case. We'd love to have as much people to help us sca scavenge some stuff. Don't? Hmm. And we might learn, learn a few things. Uh, since I'm there, I can help you identify all the nice fauna and flora, 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 fauna and flora. Yes, fauna and flora around the campus. We hmm. a nice educational trip as well. Excellent. I'll uh, catch up to you probably out there if I do decide to uh, make my way out and I don't get caught up with something. Because, uh, Captain Stuff, of you know. Course, of course, of <laughs> Yes. Uh, it was good talking to you, young fella. Hmm. I would love to talk to you more, but we should probably get attend to our own uh, business for now. Right. I'll catch you later, then. Well, I guess we're walking the same way anyway. <laughs> Oh boy. Yes. Yeah, see? What did I say? It's just yeah, him Emma. with his little shitty thirty dollar haircut. Uh, lounging around here? Oh. It's just How are you doing? Oh, oh, I'm just foraging to begin. I want to get a ah. Oh yes. He was the oh, first we're just, we're just prepping music. everything up. You you excited <laughs> to join the foraging trip? <laughs> You just want to go outside? Well, I don't know what experiences you have with him, but for me, it's a very big place out there. I believe there's a lot of running room, and we'll learn a lot of stuff from very recently. Recently. He just went to the restaurant. Yeah, he was around here like seconds ago. We're going outside. Do you know where he went? Nope. Oh, yeah, I didn't see There's obviously some weird decline. I mean, I am studying it. Yeah, maybe you will know the line when I get a bit better at it. I find a weird decline. Or grab things. Have either of you seen Yuki when we're here? No. Wasn't she with Professor no, Skyet? She just came to your ass. She went inside and said she had to go do something. But right. that was a while ago already. Right, well, I'm gonna go and try and track her down. I do plan on going on the foraging trip after all, but I'm probably gonna be coming in late, but you guys will be fine. Don't wait up for me. When is, when is the foraging thing gonna start? No idea. I'll catch you there then. Of course. Thank you, Professor. Uh, You're looking for you having some trouble yeah. again. Oh, well. I checked the dorm. She's not there. I'm presuming that she's still talking with Skyant, and uh, I just want to confirm Sky that that's the. Uh, her, asked after her not three minutes ago. Right. Well, pieces are starting to fall together. I'm going to try and see if I can at least see where she is. I plan on going on the foraging trip, though, so. You like season Kiki are going, and I told them not to wait up for me. I'll just uh, track you guys down once you're out there. You need help. I, I think I'll be fine. Okay. Thanks for asking, though. Sort of animal and fish. Is that clear? 
So I there's think, nothing no, that is that you're not allowed to hunt. Not today. Uh, okay. Today is a test to see who can bring Bombadil the finest ingredients for a price. Yes. Whether that's right. a perfect fish <laughs> or a beautiful throne, it's up to Bombadil. Just, just bring to oh, me dear. whatever you find and explain what you got. And for today, okay. I, I decided to change things up for the prize. I don't usually give a beer and ale, but this time I managed to snag myself some rare Drozen whiskey, <laughs> all the way imported from Droza. So whoever, uh, whoever gets me to find okay, I don't want, I don't want to win anymore. Experience something new. Try and stick to close to your teams for when you're called to the arena, but feel free to venture. Any and remember, you have eyesight shown of every to the professor. professor. Yeah, in eyesight of professor. But any ingredient you have shown to the professor and is approved, you may place in the wheelbarrow behind us. Is that clear? Hi. Yes, ma'am. Yes. <laughs> Hi. Roger, yes, Mr. Rizzo. They're coming too. The I next am, exit. Uh, All right. Come on, that boy's the shit out of fucking. All right. <laughs> There you are. Of course. Uh, Professor Mordred, I uh, just called to you. Professors don't move. The scene was already oh, lost somewhere. Oh, Let's not oh, worry about that. Hmm? I just look at it. What are what are we supposed to do? I didn't get. I didn't hear. We're uh, hunting and foraging. I mean, the guy Simple goal, but. Bombdale. Uh, uh, hmm. Professor Bombdale, let's find the Madari. Oh. Uh, I'm. <laughs> I'm sure this Madari is from this campus, but... Hmm. There are stray Madaris yes, around that here? Is, uh, that is one of ours. Yeah. Yes, that doesn't count. But good job, a good try. Let's uh, and catch up with Kiki and Ulysses. There's no one to turn to his hand, does that, does that uh, count as well? Oh no. Oh yeah. Wait, pardon, can you repeat that? Mm. Mm. How are we looking so far? Honestly, I'm not entirely sure what we're looking for. Uh, we'll figure it out. Out of the. Uh, Ulysses and. Uh, uh, did you see where Ulysses and Emma went? Right over the hill. I know what you mean. It took me a little while of looking around to even start to. Uh, Identify some of the species around here. Oh, no, I've lost them. Uh, I see. Ah, uh, over there. Uh, across the bridge, yeah, it looks like it. See, we can tell that Neller, that uh, the hats are a tactical advantage for spotting teammates, you know. <laughs> Well, it'll score us a few points, I suppose. Oh, you found something. Okay, let's go. <laughs> we, we, we found yeah, something. Yeah, we don't know what it is. It's a... It's I a, am not good with plants. And it's a really stuff. nice looking something. Yeah, stow that. We'll keep looking. Yeah, he was on top of the tree. He was on top of the tree. Oh. On top of this tree. 
Well, good job getting it down without hurting yourself. Because I told her to go. Everyone who was told to go, please go. Everyone who wasn't, please stay here. Okay. Did you see something of oh. those things? Oh, I didn't know was. I was on this side. Hmm. Either way, it could be a trap. We don't know why there are people around here. I didn't even know there were people in this island except for us. It wasn't supposed to be abandoned. As far as I know, I've never ventured farther from here. Okay, don't mind. The last time we saw hot sightings, we had had nasty attacks. Hmm. I believe you're all more prepared now, though, so keep your guards up. You never know what will happen. Yes. Yeah. Oh, looks like you were beaten already. You can climb it later, but don't. Uh, we still. We, we, once we get everything sorted out, then you can climb the big thing. Huh? I, I wasn't the one that climbed right. it. It was Emma. But I just saw it. it. Oh, my mistake. Some students were in that yeah. way and they said that they saw a huh. weird people around just talking for them through the hill. What, yeah, Bellacosa went there. Yeah, Bellacosa went there with few students. Hmm. Well, it looks like they're that's... coming back. All right. Um, guys, uh, you might want to play up okay? on the fridge. Yeah, just uh, Red, make make what people be. popped up. Oh, oh two. Yeah, let's uh, uh let's right. head back, I guess. Anyway, um, just just end it. Just at least. We have some outsiders, uh, and we were um, uh, asked to keep them next to the barrier for now, until further notice. So just yeah. pass the bridge, I imagine? Yeah, okay. just pass the bridge is fine. I believe we shouldn't be, you know, pulling out of weapons. Yes. Looks like our scavenging trip is... Uh, showing any hostility, or... I got something. Uh... Dangerous, in the woods. We need to defend ourselves. Oh, in this village, yes. you speak of how many of them are you? Excuse me? Can you come again? How many of the are you, how many are you in that village? We are but a small village. Uh, if we were yes, but so many, we were probably many focused. are missing. But to be honest, after but seeing don't know all this, is. Let's go ah, Chancellor, you're back. Yes. Yeah, we can hear you loud and clear. We can hear you properly. So, tell me about, about this Linvale you come from. <laughs> uh, it, it just has more village. We've been working in the past with the Lord of this castle but it's been a while now yes yeah, so i think we don't have news from the castle that, but... yeah, yeah. Hmm. it's been years since we last have we last had news of the castle. and what is your well, business Lord Lynette. 
coming to the dam. We are looking for weapons and supplies. Uh, some of our people have been mm. going missing. Uh, we suspect it's we monsters or something worse. Wow. Yeah, and the key doesn't apparently turn the blind eye on us. And we are on the blind side. Thing is an external threat. P -p Possibly. Yes. We've been working with the castle in the past. Maybe we can work something, some some deal together. Uh, I, I see you have a lot of armed people. Yeah. Children, but. We are a military facility here. And it sounds like you might need a military problem to be solved. Well, uh, sure, maybe uh, if you have hunters or something. Uh, I'm not sure about military, but. Well, I, I, I don't know. Maybe, maybe yes, maybe y yes. Uh, Maybe you, you should talk to the to the mayor, to our mayor. Uh, it's probably the. the well, the mayor doesn't usually forage. He has a lot of business. We need to visit the town, see what's going on. Sh sure, 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 sure. Uh, but uh, actually, it's been quite a. A journey for us, so uh, we humbly ask for your uh, hospitality today, maybe. Hmm. I guess we can give them some like really can... yes. yes, we can we can ask them more questions, of course. Yes, that probably be cool. all right. What do you reckon, Chancellor? Well, if we were to offer you hospitality. There will be some expectations. What kind of expectations? Uh, you do not take anything from the grounds that we do not offer you freely. You do not cause trouble, attack any of our students, or anything of the sort. Of course. We see that of course. any wrong move would cause distrust and trouble. Mostly for us, so hmm. I see the position we are in. Hmm. We only seek help. Oh, right. That's fine by me. Whatever trouble followed Your you, thoughts. whatever trouble you were dealing with, is it possible that it could have followed you? Uh, perhaps. I haven't no. seen anything. I don't... I don't know. Honestly, we, we don't even know what it is, so... Well, if right. we are to bring them inside, I can have my Madari watch them. <laughs> Make sure they don't go anywhere they shouldn't. Right. Before we bring them... Ah, before we bring them down there, though, it's best we inform the other students first that we have some new guests. Uh, you know, some students are a bit crazy when new people come in. Mm -hmm. mm. That would be a good idea. Actually, Bombardier, if you'd like to do that. Of course, of course. Uh, more protective of their home. Ah. Ah, uh, I see. Alright, so... As they're doing that, I will go do a quick scouting at the nearby forest to make sure there's no uh, yes. problems that they have followed. Do you wish for any assistance with that, sir, or are you going to do that alone? I think I'm confident Perhaps, in doing no, it alone. Take them with you. They may, they may be scouts, and this may be a ruse. Uh, you know what? Sure. I will take... I will show the uh, inside. 
Uh, Ventus, I see. There's at least three of you here. Hmm. Touch the other. You have weapons ready? Yes, sir. All right. All right. I'll be taking you out for scouting. Right. And I will leave these two in your care until we're back. I will let you take point. Lead your team. Right. Captain. Everyone, we're on Overwatch. I need someone on my left, someone on my right. I got your left. Okay, maybe I got the back. Eyes everywhere, Ulysses, you got the behind. We're not exactly sure what this threat could be if it is here, so... If there is anything that you see, no matter how mundane, feel free to call it out. Make your way over to these rocks. Let's see if we can scout this area. Anyone got eyes on any movement yet? No. Nothing so no. far. Professor Caldwell, do you have the back flank? Is running up to the side on your left. Make sure we'll keep an eye on her. I am. Do you have the back flank? I haven't heard anything either. If they were being followed, it would be by Sentin at a great distance. So. I think we're safe for now. Not to rely on the barrier. I suppose so. <sighs> Go back. All right. Pull back to the barrier. Hmm. Let's get out these woods. Everyone, double time it. Get a run on. Let's go. Yeah, with uh, Aqua, I believe. Yes. So you have a little bit of time to spend. Hmm. Enjoy your day before your lesson starts. Sir. Thank you, sir. I'm going to go in search of Kiki. Something hmm. I want to talk to her about. Right. What do you think you're going to do with the rest of your day then, Yuki? get loud sometime, I'm sorry. Yes. Uh, it's actually not a bad idea. I think I might join you if you're okay with that. Uh, you don't... You don't need to. 
Do that? Well, yeah, it's not a need. I'm, I'm okay with doing that. Come on, let's go. So, uh, what kind of stuff did you want to train on? Or, what did you want to kind of practice? I don't know. Um, I just wanted to train, I guess. Hmm. Alright, uh, well... It's uh, always nice to train with someone else. Let's see, uh, this circle should do. Uh, we could always just uh, go over fundamentals. That's usually a good, uh, good basic thing to warm up and see where it goes from there if you wanted. I can uh, help you practice uh, sword play. I hope you don't. Uh, have it as my main way of fighting, but I still know my way around. This is what you need to worry about a lot more. Tink. That's a very awkward position, you know. You don't have all your arm strength. This, uh, I'll interject. Very dangerous as well, considering these that you're reaching over. As the spike to your armpit, he could disable your entire arm with a simple one. Uh, hmm. Alright. Uh. <laughs> <Thank> <laughs> Back to square one. Mm. I just need to. If you don't mind with a little bit of, we'll say, petty tactics for spellcasters, you create your eye shield, yes? And just form it from where you're holding it. Yeah. No, I'm not going to cast my shield because my shield rises out of the ground. If, say, we were fighting, I was able to get a grab. Like I was able to grab your uh, weapon arm, doing a... I can let it go, create my shield here. I'm holding the shield. You're, you've got to rip your arm out of the ice. Hmm. Yeah. You have to worry about his shield, but... His shield's up here, worrying about your sword, and you can... To the knee. That'll probably cause a little bit of freezer burn, but... Hey, you want to try it? 
Give her enough time, it'll be frostbite. Yeah, yeah, you'll just disengage it for sure afterwards in enough time. You can handle it, right? You don't have to practice it on a living person. If you'd like to, try it. Try it on a training dummy first. Yeah, I suppose so, yeah. More well, I was curious if I could try and find a way to a get idea. out of it. That's true. I say we give it a go. Yeah, let's do it. Yeah, enough limb to work, probably. <laughs> At least just for uh, testing the fundamentals of if it works or not. Appreciate the lessons, though, Professor Caldwell. We have uh, really been lacking on time to do that. Everyone's been kind of everyone. I've been wanting to get Ventus together to do this more, but one thing leads to another, I see. I guess. Mm, well, don't mm. train too much. You are the next group for Octavian's lesson, and it looks like it's going to be a lot of physical fitness. Right. Excellent. No. Do you want to know if you're all going to continue your training some? Mm, I think we might as well take a break. <sighs> then, how would the two of you, you are wanting to learn, or care to learn, like to learn a training spell? No. Sure, I've not been able to learn one, so that'd be nice. You don't have to if you do not want to. No. I want to. I'm old and I need to sit down, so if you'd like to sit somewhere and take a break, I need to sit as well. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Tire yourself out trying to balance on your tail like that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. <laughs> Alright. So. Both of you agreed to learn it. You will have to agree again. What I'm going to teach you is a non lethal training spell. Hmm. It will have. Basically zero use outside of exercises here. And it will be complicated. Unnecessarily so. Right, well... I'm ready to give it a try. At the very least. No. Now, it's going to be difficult. Have you, either of you used um, wind magic? Mm. No. Mm -mm. I don't believe so. So, the basis of the training spell is it is a combination of, I believe, Ignis and Ventus. Fire and wind. The point of the spell is to gather a small orb of wind, pull energy away from it to make heat. This slows it down, and this makes heat. 
weakens the impact, but the heat will allow people who are wearing armor or using shields to know when they were hit. This way, we don't have something hitting hard enough for something like Val, who has full plate, to notice, and someone smaller get hit and possibly fracture a rib. Mm. So, very simple. Well, not very simple, actually. Oh, Jeff. Hmm. So, you can name it whatever you want. It is your spell once you do the formula. I'll give you the formula. Review it. Make sure you learn. I have uh, copies written down in my classroom, but I'll go over the basics first. The key part is first using wind magic. Um, Tao, you've gone through my breathing exercises. Hmm. You know the feeling for breathing in and having a feeling of power travel from in past your lungs into your solar plexus. Hmm. We'll start off with that for a little bit. Train your manacles. For now. Breathe in. Wait three seconds. And then breathe out three. Make sure you do not get lightheaded. Just your breathing if you need. Mana is in everything. Even the air. As you're breathing, I want you to think not of your breath, but of the air going in and to your lungs. I want you to imagine a part of that air following a little further. Air going in to the lungs and a portion of it just a bit further to the solar plexus. Try and hold it there for a few seconds. And then relax and release. If you begin to feel a sting, relax and let me know. Once you feel that sting, I will relax and let me know. Once you feel a sting, uh, no, that is enough. I can't. I can't let go. It's so hard to stay asleep. Get out! I can't let go. I can't stop. That is enough. Breathe out. Breathe out. Breathe. Breathe. Deep breaths. Don't go through your nose. Breathe through your mouth. You're not practicing your manipul right now. You are breathing. I don't know what that was. I... I couldn't... I couldn't let it... go. I... <sighs> All the energy built up and then it was like I was hitting a wall behind me. I couldn't go... I couldn't go back up. Then... I want you to imagine this. That's a very basic spell. You're going to take that breath, and I want you to imagine releasing it through your mouth. Just a small torrent of air. Breathe in, and then quite literally breathe out. Take that little bit of power in your solar plexus, and... Right. Now, that was the event bell. Yeah. I'll walk you to the arena. But... What you felt, that pain that stuck, that is mana. You're probably more familiar with the feeling. 
Yuki, since you cast spells frequently, you've probably felt it before during training. Mm. For you, I'll have a second very basic formula. It's not going to do much, it's not going to be useful unless you want to do party tricks of blowing cups over. But it will be a release of mana. Consider it similar to a pressure valve. Alright. You will forcefully relinquish mana. Thank you, sir. If there is a build-up that sticks, you can force it. Make it leave. And control mana. I'll talk to you again later, if you want, depending on how difficult his training is. You may want to relax afterwards. But go ahead and get over. I'll stand by and watch for the rest of Ventus. Thank you. <sighs> and if it sticks like that, make sure someone is nearby, either another professor or someone like Yuki. Mm. Someone to keep an eye on you. Mm -hmm. Aqua? Sorry for the delay. Good Marquis, it is unbecoming for one of your station to be staying over long within the sunshine uh, standing. Do allow me to uh, ease your burden somewhat. Perhaps... yes. Now, quite a formidable amount of you here today. We've already gotten through four squads, and let's just say that um, they've made me think quite a bit of this institution, and I'm hoping that you will all prove me wrong in some aspects. Now, I believe some of you were tardy, but with a reasonable excuse, so I will keep that in mind. Welcome to Combat's class, specifically against Rift Beasts. What that means is you are fighting off against the greatest terror this world has produced. What that means is you'll be fighting for the rest of your lives in order to make sure that this world stays the way it is, in a peaceful prosperity, peaceful paradise. Right now, that is quite frankly not what it is. You are all here for a purpose. You all came here to learn. And today, we will be deciding whether or not you're worthy of staying here. We will start quite simple. You, what is your name? Why are you at Rosewood? Uh, Lothariel Demoria, sir. I want to cure the devouring, sir. That's it? You just cure it? Uh, yes, sir. Nothing else? Uh, help is... Why are you stuttering? Speak up. I help in any way I can, sir, but that is what most but, means the most. No, 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 but speak up and state your mind clearly. That is what means the most to me, sir. Two steps back. You. Avi Avedan, I've come to grant people their childhood that we have been robbed of. There, and how do you do that? What are you willing to do? I'm willing to put everything I have into this so that... so that I may be able to fight these rift beasts off. Anything Two and everything. Two steps back. Move on. You. Yarrow Vanero, sir. I'm here to fight to save our world, sir. Two steps back. Next. Brown Presidium, I'm here to learn how to fight for a better future, sir. Two steps back. You do. Amari Tarasha, sir, I'm here to make sure that no one ends up like we have, that we all have a better future no matter what it takes. Two steps back. Next. Gillikin Crest, kill Rift Beast, 
Close the rifts. Stop the devour. Next. Two steps back. Tell Mustafa. Crush enemies and make sure that people have hope. What enemies? The rift beasts. Anything that stands in the way of the people that I care about. Two steps back. You. Yuki, Miss Leaf, I'm here to help take the devouring down and kill the What was that? Speak louder, I can't hear you. The Rift Beast, sir, I'm here to kill To, to what? To, to, to give them cuddles? Or, or what? To, to kill them. Two steps back. You. Kiki and Nightingale. I'm here to improve myself and fight against the beast. Two steps back. Next. You cure the devouring and the kill the beasts and rifts that brought it. Two steps back. You. Emma Keefen, I'm here to fight against what plagues this world. Two steps back. And lastly. You I see Calhoun. I'm here to better myself and rid the world of the rift beasts that plague it. Good. Two steps back. Well, I am very happy to announce that at least all the students in this institution understand why they're here. They're here to kill the Rift Beast. They're not here for their own personal pleasures. This is not a game. So I'm very happy to hear that. Quite frankly, if you gave me any other answer, you'd be on the floor right now. Very good. Very good. Now, before we move on to the next stage, I need to understand one thing through you all. And before we do that, all of your weapons out of my sight, in your rooms, in your dorms. Back here in one minute, now. Go! What are you waiting for? Run. Yelling at them. I almost... I have to hold it. Uh, I have to. Come on, get back, get back. Do not hold it. Release. Release it. Release. Are we missing anyone? Doesn't seem to be that way. Good. You arrived at a reasonable time. I'm happy to say that at least you all have... <sighs> Never mind. Now. I will mention it again, because some of you may have not heard, and some of you have already broken the rule, but you will not speak unless given permission to speak. Is that clear? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All of you respond with yes, sir. Again, is it clear? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Once more, I can't fucking hear you one more time. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> Good. Now, we get on to the most important part of why you're here. And I've mentioned it again, you're here to fight Rift Beasts. Now, would someone care to enlighten me as to what Rift Beasts are more potently weak to? Not a weakness, but more potently weak to. Yes. Magic, sir. Good. So, what does that mean? You must use magic. If you do not learn magic, you are useless in this institution. Is that clear? Yes, sir. 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 All right, starting with you. What is your main 
combat proficiency. What are you good at fighting with? My fists, sir, and weapons. That's it? That is it. Are you going to learn magic or not? Perhaps. Perhaps? Oh, no. It's not a perhaps. <laughs> it's either yes or no. Now you respond to me now very clearly. Very clearly. Yes or no? Yes. Good. You. Shield and blooded weapon, sir. That's it? No magic as well? No, but I do plan on learning it. Good. You. Swords, sir. And magic when I can. You. I focus only on divine healing, but I'm planning to learn how to use magic to go on offense as well. Next. I have the ice swords, magic, and shield. You. Shield, heavy pole arm, and chaotic magic. Very good. Next. Spear, Tonfa's daggers, as well as a crossbow, and I'm planning to learn magic, sir. Good. Next. Spears, divine magic, and ice magic. Next. One arrow, divine magic. I recently acquired a book to learn more about the all the elemental elements, sir. Good. Swords and short blades, sir. I am intending to learn magic as well. I got enhanced um, axes as well as divine healing, and I project my um, divine shields through those folk eyes. And you, last. Uh, at current, sir, I'm a uh, medic, but intend to learn more magic, sir. All right. Now that we've made our intentions clear with what we intend on learning. I want you all, actually one minute, one bef before we s go on with that, what was your name? Mine? Kiki? Yes, Kiki Nightingale. You are to stay with your captain from now on. You will understand your purpose soon. For the next Should portion of this class. Should I go behind him? I'm sorry. Yes, go, go behind, behind him. him. Stay, please. Go behind him. The two of you, the captain and Kiki, you both will be acting as one person. Is that clear? Yes, sir. Good. All right. Next, you'll be picking all of you, one partner each. As for you, two. You have 30 seconds to decide. No groveling. Keep it simple. Person on the other side of me. Yes, Amari. Okay. Cool. Sure. Let's get to it. Yuki. Bye now. It's always curious seeing how people pick when they don't know what they're uh, volunteering for. Mm. They don't. Has everyone picked? Their own partner. Yes, sir. Mm. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. For you to split up in two groups. One partner on the one side, the other on the other. Left and right. Hmm. All right. So split away from your partners. Okay. You two, you two stay together on this side. Hmm. So the reason why I separated you all is because you will be learning what it means to fight with your body first. Magic weapons come later. First you must own your own body. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir.
Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Question, sir. Good. You had a question. Yes. Are we allowed to fight until surrender, sir? Or is it knockout only? Knock out. I don't want any excuses. Will the Wraith be- Will the Wraith Beast tell you, Oh, I surrender? No, you must no, murder sir. it. Good. This is what it means, Now. Okay. Okay. Elbow, elbow. I'm gonna crumble. Slow. Give him about a minute and he'll get up. Alright, are you both injured here? Are you doing alright? Fine. Okay. Alright, you take it nice and slow. I'm gonna cast some minor healing on you. Just numb the pain. Take some time to just get up. The same goes for you, alright? Casting some minor healing. We're missing two more people. <sighs> Alright. I'm gonna cast some minor healing on you. It'll take some time. But they'll get yeah. up in about a minute. No, oh. out. <laughs> I hear great things about young town. Alright, let, let me have a look at this. He's made the decision for a long time. Take a little bit of time to get up. You'll be fine. Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna numb the oh. pain a little bit. I should. Good. I'll give him about right. 30 seconds and he'll be out. Okay. Ah, uh, you my throat. Although, he got you in my throat. Oh. It's good to know that people are stronger than me, because that means that we have good fighters here. I'm not mad. I'm not mad. Once you walk it up, I want you to face me again, line for line. If you have one, I want you to be on my right. Who has fallen on my left? <laughs> You're not too bad yourself, though. The foreman reactiveness could use a little work. All right. Uh. Right. That was one of the windows. Would I go again? Right. 
Sorry? Did you win or lose? I won. You won. Over there. Okay. Small surprise that is. I want, I want you all to get a little closer. Still in the same line. All right. For those who have lost, let this be a valuable lesson to you. Life is unfair. Rift Beasts do not care if you're on your own or if you have friends. They do not care if you have a weapon, do not care if you have magic on you. You must learn what it means to survive and to thrive in this world. Losers must do 500 squats now. As for the rest oh. of you who are one, you must in you must observe. You gonna squat? Observe them individually, and if they even falter for a second, you will all be joining them. Let's as go. Well. Keep a close eye on them. Wings out in front of you. Get on with gonna it. make it a little bit more balanced. You both must squat. We're already on it. Moving closer. Make sure they're not even for a second. Counting something that is wrong. Do not miscounting and make sure they do not stop for five seconds. Sorry, it's okay. I underestimated your mask. It's a fucking face shield. That thing is robust. Oh no. Find something to stare at. Just stare at one point and do it. You got it. 75. Focus on the form, not on the pain. Out of character, you can't. Don't feel the need. Okay. You got this. Kick his contest. They're gonna punish you. Don't do it. No. They're gonna just punish you. They're gonna punish you. It's fine. Stop. They're gonna punish you. You gotta let her do it. You gotta let her do it. Come on. Come on. You got it. I have a Stand up and give another ten. Come on. There's another ten. Four. Five. Six. Come on. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. You're done. Four. Three. I said you may stop. Two. You're good to stop. <laughs> Relax. Take a minute. Take a breather in. It's good. I can't feel my face. face is pretty bad. You have one minute. After you have rested, you are to single file line shoulder yeah, once more. I will okay. be back. Good job. Good job. Good job. Let's get back in line. Slow and steady. 
Yeah. Um, Professor Skyet. Chilani. Yeah. One uh, moment. Chilani, you <laughs> I need to speak with you both. Uh, ah, I can feel my legs. Not again. using any healing yeah. magic here, but. Ventus. Sam? Okay. Okay. Cool it down a little. Maybe oh. if I didn't that that way. <laughs> Please. Yeah. A moment. Thanks. Problem. I want you both to take your teams. After you're finished, take them to the mess. All right, your minute is over. Stand Give up. them water and rest. Understood. That's already my game plan. It will be done. Good. Well done. Let's go. With everything that you have witnessed in this class, I hope you all learn something. And slowly, little by little, I am gaining your respect. Hopefully. I I will let you all know right now that you all have promise, but it's still too early. You're not ready. But I like what I see in you all. The next class, you will be bringing your weapons into the arena. Is that clear? Yes, sir. 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 Good. Class is dismissed. You may leave. Get out of my sight. Ventus, we all, everyone stick with me. Don't go running off. Oh, my God. Do not run anymore today, Tao, please. Because I don't think I can run. I can barely walk. Oh. Do what you can, just don't go anywhere. Follow me. Oh, my God. I'm going to get some human hands on that. I'm going to get a mean punch on that shield. Hey, you free. We're making our way to the mess hall. Everyone, come on. When you're free, I would just like a, a, a bit of, uh, take a bit of conversation. I just need some advice from you. You all did well. Hey, Ventus. Ooh. Hey, Luca. All right, everyone. Hey, um, mess hall. Come have on. Have you seen Emma? Emma's with us. Yeah, We're busy. Do you need to okay, talk to her? Uh, just let her know I need to talk to her maybe yeah, tomorrow or something. It'll be done. We can let that let you know. Do you have a note or something? We could pass that too. Uh, yeah, I just need her help. Um, I'm working on a thing for Aether Tech, and I need someone's help that's in alchemy. And so I was just, I heard that she's looking to do explosion things. Got and, it. Yeah. Yeah, I'll let her know. She is an alchemy, so is Talia. She's making her way there. Great. Okay, well, unfortunately, I, I do have to go. So I'll, I'll, I'll really just let her know. For me, please. You're fine. Very Thank well. You. Oh, oh, my legs. Oh, my legs. Make your way to the mess hall. Grab something, you know, fill in. We're going to need to refill our energy well, well, and well, what did you say? muscles and everything. What did you say? Go get food and water. You want us to eat? Yes. Ah, okay. After an intense workout, you need to get all of your carbohydrates back. That's an order. Go. Oh, I'm gonna get so such thick roots. Oh. Where's Kiki? There you are. Right behind you. Hey, we're gonna go sit down in the mess hall, all right? Please. If you get a little bit of food and some water, it'll help you feel better. At least a little bit, all right? You think you can make it there? You can ride my shoulders if you'd like. Miss Kiki. We'll take care of it. Uh, Mr. Talwani. Hmm. I would let, like to let you know that I did speak with Mr. Ivil the other day. Didn't it go it well? No longer your problem. It did go well. Whether or not he decides of his own heart to come apologize and give reparations is up to him. 
Regardless, thanks for uh, doing that. Uh, it will. Of course. But please, see to your teammate. She's been very distraught. Hmm. Remember everyone, water and something with high carbs. For you too, Captain. Everything okay? Training killed my team. Yeah. I'm willing to bet that it did for a lot of other people too. We got... Yeah. Uh, who did you guys have to? You guys were against uh, Aqua or? Yeah. Woman? Aqua. Aqua. Kiki and I were put on a team because Kiki's was... still not confident with her uh, combat skills yet, so. She basically stood behind me and watched me take on both Yuki and Amari at the same time. Oof. She's not taking yeah, it well. Amari would be a tough one. Mm. You're doing okay, though? I had to live then. I'm used to it. At least enough that I can feel like I do and then still not be totally in a bad mood because of it, but... It's not like it's something I enjoyed doing back when it was a caravan. It was just either deal with that kind of physical stress or sit down and die in a desert somewhere. So you kind of had to have thick skin about being, you know, overexerted, I guess. But everyone's not me. And it's definitely a, a big first class, I guess. Yeah. He sure as hell put out an impression. Hmm. Uh, I think it's a good thing, but at the same time, it was very uh, stressful. Yeah. Yeah, it's gonna be a rude awakening for those of the those of us that aren't used to it and painfully familiar for those who are. Are the other three, four? Yuki, Emma. Well, Yuki got oh, yeah. Yuki got chewed out by him because you know her. She's exactly the antithesis of what he wants out of someone who responds to him. Ulysses did fine. Talia did fine. Emma did her best, but I think that her just not liking his attitude made her responses, you know, kind of already set her onto a. Bad course as far as him. Yeah. Well, good. Mm -hmm. Alright. Let me know if you need anyone that... mm. to help. Alright. I appreciate it. Same goes back to you. What did Hammer go up against again? I didn't see a member of Aqua, I think, either. Yorl, or possibly Avi? I am not sure. Surprised that Emma got beaten. I expect her to. Oh well. I kind of got uh, blinds on the side of my face the moment the fighting started, so. Mm -hmm. Just let him They probably know about Kiki. Out. Hmm. All right. Hope the best for you, Captain. Same to you, Cap. All right. Make sure you rest well. Hmm. Why does he dismiss her? Hmm. <laughs> because she doesn't have Why? hands. Emma. Oh. Well, that's. Jesus. 
I mean... No shit. Honestly, yeah. if it gets her out of harm's way, good. Yeah, that's better than someone needing to beat the shit out of her. Guys, I, I just want to say, uh, I... What? I, I know... You wanted to say hi? The, the professor... That too, I guess. But, uh, I know the professor is harsh. I just hope that yeah. everyone's fine. I, I destroyed my legs. She destroyed I, my I, face. I uh, you, I your mask destroyed my hand. Destroyed your hand. Yeah, just... I've been through worse, Suko. I'm pretty sure all of us here have. Yeah. We'll be fine. Your hand in. No. <laughs> Anyways, how's Murtex? Is he still banging? Is he still banging professors in the head? Cause I got a couple he could. I'll pull on it lightly. I got it. A little bit of hurts. Might be broken. You okay? You okay? You okay? You okay? Can you hear me? You kiss me. You kiss how? What is? What is so cold? It's me. You me. We're all trying to work hard, and it's not going to be easy, I know. And it seems like stuff consistently gets more and more complicated, but we're all going through this together, and we are going to stay with you. It's alright to be scared and confused. It's very human. It's very... 
It's very real feelings that everyone has. I was the one who made you a lieutenant. I believe in you that much. And it's all right that you still have room to grow. Because I know I certainly do as a leader. You're doing a great job as leader. I can always still do better. And you can too. I don't know if I can. I believe you can. If you want to believe in something, believe in how confident I am of you. At least try for my sake. You went Very from... Huh? For you were sick. You went from the outskirts of a small town, having to fend for yourself, not having anything, and now look at you. I can't say or know how you think of yourself, but... But from what you've told me, and from what I used to see you as, back those several months ago when we first just met, I've seen a lot of change. Hey, you what the fuck are you doing here? We made our way here and everything of the day just kind of got to us, but we'll be okay. Are you having an emotional breakdown? And that's one way to call it, I guess, but honestly, it's you know. <clears throat> He's pretty bad, too. He's not taking in the uh, reality of the situation very well. And I assume you, you, Yuki's having a hard time with it, too. I mean, the professor was right upon her face yelling at her. Yeah, yeah, I noticed. And he also made her beat, beat the shit out of you. I noticed that very well, too. My gut instinct was uh, very, very close to getting me in a lot of trouble. I am surprised that I held on. Yeah. But, um... Honestly, I just told him what he wanted to hear. Usually it's the best way to go about with these professors. Just tell them what they want to hear. It doesn't matter if it's true. Just tell them what they want to hear. That's very if you true. Do, they'll leave you alone. And that's basically what I did. And I, I, quite frankly, I give zero fucks about the beasts, and I really don't care about saving the world or all that fucking jazz. I don't care. I really don't care. But if it gets me out of that professor's bad light, sure. He can, he can believe whatever he wants. They don't define you, Yuki. No matter what they say, these people have no fucking idea what the hell they're doing. I mean, no one does. Nobody's prepared for what the fuck the, what, what the world's been turned into. But it's a preposterous to even believe that any of them have any sort of plan. Sure, some of them may have an idea of what to do. But if that idea works or not, it's very, very up to the debate. They're just as confused and I dare say scared as of anyone else. Even and they're dick bags too. A lot of them are dick. A lot of them are dicks. They have they have this like they have this really, really thick log shoved up their ass. So it's a hard time for them to bend down. They always have to walk, walk up straight. Hard ass and dickheads. It doesn't matter what they say. Yuki. 
You have a bit of trouble with talking to people? Sure, you do, you do. But you're just as capable as any one of us. I mean, for God's sake, when when Tao sometimes sleeps in, you're the one that picks up the reins, and you do a splendid job at it. I mean, you're perfectly capable. He doesn't know that. He's never seen you. He doesn't know you. Who the fuck is he to tell you how you are, who you are, what you are? Just the men yelling because there's nothing else he knows how to do or thinks about how to do. You should look him straight in the fuck in the face and you don't falter. Look him straight in the face. Not gonna bite you. I mean, if you if you did it to him, it probably be it probably be a lot worse. How to like look at him? He's got massive talons. I mean, teeth. Yeah, I don't Tusks. have I don't have a yeah, problem yeah. breaking one off inside of someone either. These will grow back just fine. Exactly. See, that's really cool. Also, Professor Cadwell uh, wants to talk to you for whenever you have free time. He's Noted. In his office in the main building. Noted. That's um, what I was looking for, both of you. I'll see if I have the Maybe time. Maybe if you but... eat a cookie, it make you feel better. Something sweet can also can also make you feel weak. Hmm. I should call to Caldwell. And plus, you're not alone, Yugi. You got us? Look. Right here. We're a team. We have to... We'll do this together. No Hi. running off. Oh. It's fine. No running off. Really tight if group you hug. To deal with this. <clears throat> we have... Please, I am, I am in tremendous pain, please. All right, I'll loosen up a little bit. Here we go. Hold on. All right, there. Thank you. <sighs> Uh, forgot if you. you to with forgot problem, you guys. We have to deal with it together. It's a lot easier to do than alone. Mm. A lot easier to do with things. Sometimes, you know, it may feel like being alone is the best case scenario because you don't want to get yourself in another situation like in the past, but maybe, maybe that's not the best choice. Yeah, here comes, you should open here, comes here comes Ulysses with all the big brain takes. This is this is why he's on the team. Yeah, one of the reasons why he's on the team. Exactly, yeah. This is why we pay him the big I'm bucks. I'm not always sentimental, but sometimes. What is a box? I don't know. I think it means money. What is box? Does it mean money? Mm. Maybe. If people usually say coin, that's what I hear them say. say coin, oh, such... You have coin for that. Yeah, apparently people use buck. Like a buck maybe has to do with like trading chickens. Maybe it's just like that. So they well, just call it, it they call it bucks for like a slang. Anyways, it's not important. Uh, what yes. is important is that I'm right there with you, Lysis. Yeah. I had that same mentality for a long time. Frankly, I think I still do. But seeing you like this, it does make a question. Maybe opening up just a little bit isn't bad. It really yeah. does build up. Thanks for getting that message to us, though. We should probably start walking our way back. Mm hmm. Yeah. Are you going to be able I to. I didn't even know this was way back? I really need to go up some more. I just realized that. <sighs> My body hurts. Yeah. It, 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 it is considerable pain for me just to sit and stand up, and I feel it more when I walk. All right. Come on. Yeah. Hold on. Uh, you did it for me that one day, now it's my turn. But you're a little tired. I'm hurting very much, but I'd rather us hurt together than alone. Yep. Just like I taught you. 
Your life is on three. We lock arms and we pick her up. Okay. No, 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 please. Three, go. All right, quickly before our arms give out. Should be good. Yeah. Uh, oh. <laughs> oh, oh. Oh, my arm. You're really heavy. No offense. You exploded. Uh, we are an entire uh, person. Uh, oh. Alright, Ulysses, you're officially on don't do nothing for the rest of the night duty. That's an order. for an interior project that I proposed today and was greatly received. That can be done while sitting. I can prove you that. Like to, you, you like to... You like to... You like to do metal work, right, Tal? I love to do metal work. Imagine if you could have a portable forge with you. That'd be amazing. At any time. Is that a thing that exists? I thought that was exactly. only fantasy. I have the things I'm making. Keep me updated on that. Like seriously, I will. Well, it won't be. An, it won't be a literal forge. What well, the idea I had was to make some sort of concentrated flame. So instead of, for example, imagine you have a crack in a piece of armor. Instead of having to put it all over again in a forge, you just go there very quickly. You just go, and you can melt the metal and close it back up. So field repairs at any point in a battle, any time, without needing a, a forge or any or redoing the entire. Um, yeah, without you know, having to reset all piece the pieces. Of armor. Huh. Exactly. Imagine the utility this could have. The possibilities. Yeah. Now, there's one issue, though, that this, this death bed expends a lot of energy, and I have to find a way to either make the battery not uh, last long enough, or make it exchangeable. Hello. That's what I'll be doing. I have to think of that. Regardless, please do try and recover, so that way, by the time classes start tomorrow, you're not dead like I might be, unless I follow suit. I will attempt to, I guess. What time is it? Yeah, I will attempt to. Maybe shortly I'll go to bed so I don't collapse. Hmm. But not yet. I am still thinking. Right. Also, I want to know how Kiki is doing, because I am very worried of her. Yeah, where is she? She uh, went with Professor Bellicosa. She apparently had somebody with offensive divine magic to show her which is something that she really really wants to get into because of all fucking Miller went to talk to her telling that she's useless because she doesn't know how to attack she doesn't have any hands so she's a burden to team ventus and now she's feeling horrible about herself i'll keep that in mind exactly. I want oh, that's convenient. Coming over. Oh, hey so i uh, got a summons Yes, if there's some good team would like to stay as well. Hmm. I think that'd be preferred. Uh, you we're... head over to my classroom. Okay. Ulysses, do you want to come or try and find Kiki? Either is fine. Chancellor, do you know, is Professor Bubba close in her classroom? I do know uh, where she is, I don't the last I saw her, she was down by the training fields. Oh, professor. Well, 
Do you have a moment, uh, what I have a moment you could time afterwards? No, I, I was just going to take a check on my DB I think she is with her. Of course. Ah, then yes, you may want to check her bathroom. I believe it is around the corner, or perhaps upstairs. I'm not quite sure. I see. Where's Professor Caswell's classroom? I believe that's right over here, actually. Yes, mine is the one directly next to the missile. Stand wherever you prefer. We've done a lot of standing and uh, mm -hmm. squats, so a little bit of bit. sitting can hurt. Well. <clears throat> Are you willing to share a bit of paper for homework? Hmm? I, th I think we can do that. Mm. Here's two pages one for each of you it has the written instructions and the formula for that training bolt spell hmm. it is mostly um, if anyone else on the rest of your team wants to learn then you have it you can share it hmm. I'll hopefully be teaching them in it anyways if they decide to learn it yeah And take this stool real quick. Sit down. Because it's been a long day. And I am old. If, if I'm middle age. Alright. The reason I wanted to speak was for what happened to you earlier. Hmm. I want to make sure you understand. Do not train alone. I'm sure you'll want to. I'm sure it's frustrating knowing that in terms of what I am teaching you, you can't train alone right now. But it is for your own safety. If mana sticks inside of the... Uh, Mana pull for too long from an external source. You pull mana in and it stays too long, it can have permanent damage. It can also lead to mana poisoning. Preferably, it leads to mana poisoning. Mana because at least with mana poisoning, your body releases it. Hmm. If mana is held in the body for too long, or there's too much of it, like, um, I'm sure you'll, I'm, I'm sure you've seen at least one person drink a mana potion, yes? Mm -hmm. A mana potion restores half your mana pool. If you're above half, it overfills it. You hmm. gain mana poisoning. You will become nauseous. You will be in a lot of pain. Worst case scenario, you are disoriented as well. And that is the last thing you need. And that's the worst part. Even if you're just slightly over, just barely over half your mana pool, you drink that mana potion, you get mana poisoning. So if you practice alone, best case scenario, you're nauseous. You're sick. Maybe dizzy. Worst case scenario, you start to face... essentially backlash. A odd kind of equivalent to it. If it is bad enough, enough backlashes happen, or you try to train by yourself, 
and you're not able to release the mana. You mana poison yourself too often. The damage to your mana pool can be permanent, and you can lose the ability to ever cast magic again. This goes for everyone. That's why you, if you're going to practice a new spell, if you're going to create a spell, peer review it. Run it past two, three people. Run it past me. I will always have time, even if it is during my own time off. I'm sitting there with very little to do, or even if I have a lot to do. If you come to me with a spell that you're trying to learn, or a spell that you've created, I will review it. I may even try casting it once or twice just to make sure that it's not going to have adverse effects. You both understand? I do. Yes. So, anytime you're training, I want someone with you. Doesn't have to be a professor, but it has to be someone you trust. And worse comes to worse, someone you can trust to either call on others, or carry you themselves to the infirmary. Hmm. For your practice. It took, what, about five, six seconds before that stink kicked in? Hmm where the mana sat and coalesced and you couldn't get rid of it? Yes, it it felt like... I want you to... I don't know, like... Like you said and described it, I could f sort of physically uh, feel yeah. the representation of the mana flowing through and everything. And I could feel something. But, I don't know, it's like... It's almost as if it just got so confused and couldn't find its way out. I was genuinely trying, but... I... I don't know. I... found it feeling just... like I was constantly ramming it against a... closed, locked door, and... that only made everything just... feel worse. Man. There is a very simple spell. First level, only because we have nothing smaller. Here, let me see your paper real quick. I need to get my pen real quick. I'm going to... put a small formula. What this is, is it is going to basically... <laughs> as stupid as it sounds, one of the first wind-based spells I was ever taught was a spell that basically doubled the strength of me blowing air out of my mouth. There's no use for it, unless you really want to make sure you win a competition for blowing out candles. Hmm. But... For you, it can have a secondary purpose. You'll have to chant words for it. Review the formula. Find some words that work for you. Something you can say even if you're struggling. Something you can chant. You'll sound a little louder because of the amount of air going out, the extra force. But it should help the force mana through you. But you have to chant, and in the case, the worst part, truthfully, you're gonna have to practice it. Hmm. So, before you continue on with your lesson of the training bolts, I want you to learn this one first. Work with the others. Make sure someone's sitting with you. It's a very simple formula. Should take you a day or two of focused practice before you should be comfortable enough memorizing it. Hmm. It's not going to be useful for anything except this. 
you ever feel that wall, I am quite literally giving you a spell to blow it down. You are going to have a spell and a chance, whatever you decide to make that chance. Specifically so you can force mana to start traveling. Give it a spell to funnel through. Consider this spell your release valve. When, like I said, it'll take a day or two before you can even start casting it. But as a day or two, you'll have to work with someone on your team. Or even me. It'll be probably easier, more comfortable for you with your team. Where they're going to have to watch you and make sure that you don't mana poison yourself. And if something goes wrong, can you get mana poisoning? Seesaw practice. Do not try gathering mana. Do not try casting that spell. You mana po if you get mana poisoning, you are done for the day. You'll have to wait. It'll take longer every time you get mana poisoned. And you can basically look at it as an extra day it's going to take you before you can actually learn that spell to act as a release valve. But it can help you in a, a longer run. Give you an outlet for mana. Hmm. And even if it takes a week or two, it'll be useful. I can't solve all your problems. <laughs> Much as I wish I could. And I can give you tools to try and work through it. It's that formula is not going to do anything by itself unless you patch it for days and you have people you can trust to watch you. It's all more than I had, so that's already something, and I appreciate it. Yeah. Isn't magic great? Simple solution. Here's a. Here's Super easy spell. I'll help you release your mana. Bad news, to even learn this spell, you're gonna have to deal with your problem. Three days, probably. Or maybe. Depends if you get mana poisoning. Depends on how well you can mm. actually train it and how much time you get. Hmm. I guess there's nothing for it, but to uh, try and learn. If I could give you simple solutions, it'd be... Well, I'd be teaching you how to use weapons instead. Can't cut your problem, stab it. Can't stab your problem, grab the mace. Hmm. Those don't work well. Grapple it. Magic. You have a problem with mana? I can give you a spell. You have to deal with your magic problem once you get to it, though. No. If I don't give it a shot, it'll just keep, uh. keep causing problems for me. And I'll have nobody to blame but myself. That's mostly what I brought you over here for, unless either of you have questions or things you want to discuss. After everything that we did today, I Should probably, uh, <laughs> whoa. I'll probably go into the floor. <laughs> yep, that was just me. Just me doing that. Anyways. <laughs> Really tired tonight, so I'm probably not going to try to attempt even anything, and probably just get my thoughts together. A lot's happened. Yeah. Well, you can review the formula of the training spell with the others. I do not want you casting it. Hmm. 
You can review it, you can memorize it. Learn the simple spell first. Magic be cursed. No, it's been. There is magic that is based on curses. Mm. But there is a very specific reason for it. It is a curse cast on a person. Magic itself is not a curse, usually. There are unfavorable conditions, sometimes, but not a curse. No. I feel clawing at me. Would you like to see what a curse looks like? A true curse. I'm just a simple... Believing it's a curse. Mm -hmm. I've been trying to keep him away, but... Mana potion. Remember I said you drink too much? You get mana poisoning. Mm -hmm. You either drink twice, or you have it while you're over half mana. Well, come on, you fuck. <laughs> Professor. Uh. Uh. Oh, that mana you wanted you. Do you, do you need help to stand? No. That is a curse. What? What even was that? My old teacher. A, a curse from your old teacher? Yeah. a curse. As a true curse. Don't mind, I'm gonna sit down for a second. So there is cursed magic. Magic that creates curses. Magic itself is not a curse. I don't care. 
very strong. Red snow comes out. It never really matters on place mm. either. It's happened multiple times uh, several months ago. And just reason lead to tonight. spellcasters some well all spellcasters often have an aura show when they are casting their spells especially stronger spells some spellcasters cannot suppress their aura at all times I'm sure you've seen it before with students here they get too angry too emotional one way or another, and you'll see stuff around them. It looks like magic flowing. What is not? It is not magic. It's not a spell. It is mana. That is why you feel tired, drained afterwards. Mm. You're not cursed. You just haven't been taught how to suppress your mana. Truthfully, within society, there is nothing wrong with it. Some people honestly accept it, because it is a manifestation of your true emotions. But, you are here. You are in a situation where you'll have to fight, or you may gain enemies. And having your aura show can be very dangerous. I think that's already a good amount. Uh, I've used up enough of your time. So the rest of your team's looking for you. Or waiting for you. Mm. Mm. Truthfully, I wouldn't mind walking along. Talking to the rest of them, too. I need to be in present when you tell them. Mm. When you let them know. Whatever you decide to let them know. But that's up to you. That's your team. Your captain. Hmm. 
I feel like I can trust them with that kind of information and that they'd appreciate knowing. It's... It's something we'll talk about. Then the option is also yours. Do I go along with? And be present when you give the information? Or would you rather that be a team business? At some point tomorrow, I have a long list of things I need to get done. I can add that to it, if you would have a time where you'd be able to stop by. Your list is too long. Don't add me to it, just uh, burden yourself. But if time is free, I will stop by. And then, if time is free. Don't burn yourself. Where the professors were teaching you. Mm. Hmm. All right. Would you like to go ahead and go? Meet mm. the third stupid team. I'm gonna stop by the arena, see if anyone's there. Hmm. Well, thanks again. Thank you. Thank you, Professor. And double check, make sure you have your papers with you with the formulas. Got it right in my satchel. Uh, yeah, we're free to go. Late night. You doing all right? Yeah, fine. I was hoping to speak with the professor. If he had a moment. He uh, should be free now. He's in there. I have one. Yeah. There you are. Ah, oh, we're just coming to see you guys. Hey. Sorry, never wanted to see me, and then Bella Cosa. Tomorrow's Kayette also wants to see me. Oh. He keeps very popular. How'd you guys, how'd you guys think with Cadwell go? Uh, very... I'd call him well. We got some stuff to, uh, do. We've got a special spell that I'm supposed to practice, and then both Yuki and I have another one we'll that we're supposed along. to be uh, kind of going along with. And, yeah, that's exactly the point. I'm not allowed to practice the same spell that Yuki is practicing until I get another one down. And even then, I'm not supposed to try and learn that one without at least someone with me. So if I ask one of you guys, just kind of sit somewhere while I practice and say some weird things, That's that's what that is. What do you mean, weird thing? Mm. Of course. It's an incantation. Oh. I have to, uh, use words. Ah. My god, for a team that always okay, thinks you're difficult humor. to find! Hey, Emma. Uh. Ah. Oh, you're so, What the... Mm. Enjoying the night. Hey, no, it's not your fault. You were busy. Yeah. Indeed. Alright. Anyway, the tats? We could start at least the prep work for that, <laughs> but what? What? What about this? What the fuck? Uh, I wanted permission if I can bring poisonous plants to the dorm. Bring poisonous plants to the dorm. Do they bite? You know that make that make them venomous. You can leave them on Emma's bed. She doesn't use it anyways. Yes, I do. Maybe don't do that. Maybe just leave them on a the table somewhere. You know. Do one of the teachers so know that you're doing this? Morning, this? Be there. I'll ask Bombadil tomorrow. I'm a morning person. I wake up early. Oh, you're not doing it yet. <laughs> I thought you were doing it now. 
Get permission first. Sure. You want to make sure that Mur you can... Uh... Murtash hit Bombadil in the head with his stick today. I wanted to share this with all of you. Very, very, very rude. No, it was really funny. It was also really ironic you, because he had been, it had been messing okay. with me and Emma. So he got hit in the head. Mm. Yeah. And we got okay. whiskey. Talk to Bombadil. That's true. We did get whiskey. We won? No, I won. Or Emma and me that, did that something for Bombadil. Won. Ah. We won, yes. We, we, we won. We won. Team and all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We won. What? You guys enjoy it. We, we just... We, we did something, me, me and Emma did something for Bombadil and he gave us whiskey. So we have peak frozen whiskey to, 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 to yeah. drink. You guys should enjoy if that. you guys want some. Kiki, you can. I just prefer you don't do it alone. No. Don't drink alone. That's okay. sad. Not a whiskey. I'm thinking of ways to combat better. Professor Neller gave me some advice. He gave you a lot of things, but I don't think it was very good advice. How do you feel? He gave you, he gave you lack of self confidence. Yeah. Sad. But will for me to bash his skull then? Ah. I know that feeling. For what it's worth, Kiki. You were a good member I of the feel... team before, and you're a good member of the team now. Exactly. I'll be even better. I'll grow stronger now. We grow stronger together. They didn't want us to be... If they wanted us to each be perfect on our own, they wouldn't put us in teams. Very true. That's true. Still. There's many things that can happen in battle. Or in life in general. I have to be able to hold out on my own. If you want to do it, nobody's gonna stop you, Kiki. It's your journey after all. But remember, we're always here. Always. Hmm. Mm -hmm. I know. Right, Emma. Yes. See? <laughs> I talked to Bella Cosa, and I think I have an idea what to do now. Gonna copy Abby's, mm. Abby's idea and put the divine blades on my wings. So I don't have to think about how they will keep up, only how I will conjure them around them. Mm. Yeah. A great idea. Mm -hmm. you we were talking about blades a little see. bit earlier, so that is a splendid idea. I think that would be really cool. Make him shoot out even. Hmm. Whatever the case, it's got to be something that is going to work for you. Exactly. We have some very large shoes to fill, but that doesn't mean that we have to lose ourselves along the way. Mm hmm. We'll see about that, but I'm tired. We all are. Good I'm work. gonna head to bed. Good work during class today. Good night. Good night. Good, Good night, night, Kiki. Good night, Kiki. Rest well. Okay, um, Sleep uh, well. out of character, if someone tries to use, like, the oven or the kitchen, you will see bits of, like, green fabric around the kitchen. Okay. We have an oven? <laughs> yes! There's a bee? Something similar. I didn't look at, I just went to the kitchen once, but you will see green fabric around places. Oh, yeah, that oh. fucking thing over there, yeah. <laughs> no, my God. <laughs> Hold on, I have to have a look at the furnace. Like I know Anyways, we're standing outside like a bunch of vagrants. Let's go in sewers. Yeah. Yeah, why inside's when we're, oh, I'm tired. Uh, All right, so... so Tattoo stuff. Uh, I could start doing the pre stuff, just like measuring and trying to get a good, little bit of a good idea with the sketches that you gave me. 
We could probably do at least a little bit of the line work tonight and then probably do more of it tomorrow. We're going to need to find a place. I need to know where you're going to be the most comfortable, but where I'm going to have to access to either your leg or your back. I just the back hip. I can, like, sit or stand up. I don't know. All right, I'll just use the seat behind you. You laid down on, like, the couch or something. All right. Okay. I'll go grab my things and then, uh, be back. Everyone's, uh, just missed, obviously. I am slurring my words because I'm very tired, but I can still, still do this. Your chief? Shouldn't you be hearing us in morning? <laughs> I mean, I'll just do, like, the light stuff today. You know? You can do the I don't know what this one. Emma. Were you yeah, getting it, Emma? Skirt. Never thought I'd see you again. Yeah, okay, we do like this, and then over there. And then like, start doing it. I don't know how tattoos yeah. are made, but he can do whatever the fuck he needs to do, like, tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, that's fine with me. Dusty old chest. <laughs> yeah, that shit dusty, boy. Well, this was a splendid, heartfelt moment. But the pain in my body is beginning to reach levels I cannot handle. I'm gonna go to bed. Sounds like a plan to me. I'll probably be following suit here soon. Yeah, I am in horrid pain. Good night, everybody. Lie down in a position you can stand up from. You're I'm, gonna feel I'll stiff sleep. in the morning. I'll sleep straight, hard as a lawn. I'll wake up hard, too. Good night. <laughs> Don't wake up hard, please. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I see. Um... <laughs> don't worry about it. <laughs> Honestly, it's probably best you don't. If you want to know, I'll tell you later. Looking like your old grandpa. You should go to bed. Hmm. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. I got it. Oh, big guy. Time to go to bed. Come on. I was, I was gonna make my way there. You know, eventually. When I had... <laughs> After your nap. <sighs> You know, this chair is not that uncomfortable. I could probably just sleep in here. It's fine. No. Get your noodle legs up those stairs and to your bed. <sighs> you need a hand? <clears throat> no, I could do it. Just give me a... <clears throat> okay, bad start. That was just a bad start. That was all it was, Very a bad best. start. It helps you. Mm -hmm. Oh. Okay. Come on. Good night, guys. Good night. Good night. Is it 
it's still so hard to stay asleep. I can't believe I still let this get to me. Why is it still so hard? I can't sleep. I can barely do what I want to do. I'm nervous around the people that I care about. Why won't that voice in my head just be quiet? For once, just be silent. They need me, and they need me in one piece. I need to get this under control. But why can't I just...